Hey guys, this is Jamie Little Tallulah, and I am here for a tattered lace haul. Yes, yes, yes. So let me go through and show you what came. And I'm like so excited because I have like this was the day of dyes. I tell you, all these dyes came today, and um, so forth. So first of all, the tattered lace issue 44 came today. And it's a month late, once again. And in August, we should have had issue 45, and I have not received it yet. So let me say this. Um, I will never subscribe to this magazine again. Um, the service on this magazine subscription has been horrible. The claims that they make as far as things being exclusive turned out to be not true. Um... It's never produced on time, and it has just been a nightmare as far as a subscription goes. Um, the magazine itself, although it has interesting projects and so forth like that, pretty much after you've seen about four or five issues, it's kind of got the same stuff all over again. Um, so pretty much now I'm to the point where all I want is for my subscription to be over. You know what I mean? I seriously, if I could get my money back, I would. So I would never, ever subscribe to this magazine again. Um, I've never had a subscription that was this bad. I mean, the whole point of having a subscription is to get it before everybody else. And you can buy the subscription on her website before you can get your subscription that you paid for as a subscriber, which is totally not right. And... You know, this one, 45, I think it was either this issue or issue 45 wasn't even printed on time. So, yeah, I will never, ever get this subscription again. And to be honest, I probably will not even buy this magazine unless I really, really like the dye on the front because that's all I pretty much buy it for now. Um, so, yeah, so I'm not even really going to do much to this other than show you that yeah, those are the dyes I bought. Um, They've got some same kind of stuff they always have. And once again, I'm just not that impressed. So, yeah, I will probably never, well, I know I'll never subscribe to it again. And I doubt that I'll buy very many issues of it. So there's that. And I took the papers out because now I do like the paper designs that they come up with. But it's not worth the magazine. You know, they give you these little amounts of papers and they talked about how you can download them and so forth. So before my subscription runs out, I will download all the papers and then that'll be it. So I will not be getting this magazine again. Okay, so let me show you the die that came with it. It is called the Carnation Posy. So here is the die and it is a, it's a decent sized die. Now, the die, I have no problem with their dies. Their dies always seem to work. Um, here's what it looks like cut out. But yeah, I will not be buying a subscription. Okay, so there's that subscription over. Now, let me show you some of the dies that I got. I got this die set. Look at that mouse. This is what pretty much sold it for me. And then you have the whole gourd pumpkins. Isn't that cute? Like I said, I love their dyes. But that magazine subscription is a no-go for me ever again. And their customer service, her customer service on this was terrible. Terrible. From Create and Craft and from when I sent them a, a, I put a comment on their Facebook page. Oh, well, we'll contact you through email. That was like over a month ago, and I still have not heard anything from them. So, yeah, their customer service on their magazine subscription is crap. So, there's that die. Look at that. So cute. I love it. And then here's the little mouse. It's precious. It's so precious. It took forever to get these dies, too. <laughs> Oh my gosh. So then they had another collection and this was, I can't even remember what it's called, but it's a charisma collection. 
and they had this as a weekender or something and I really only liked this one they had your circles oval squares and I just love this one I loved the detail on the edges right huge die look at that so here's the flowers isn't it awesome so there's the flowers here's the frame when you cut the center piece out look how big that is that is fabulous so there's the center and then of course here's the center piece so once again you could cut it into different colors inlay it you could pop this up do all kinds of stuff with it and then here it is without the center cut out so you get that idea right right oh my gosh so that was that then I did buy I cannot remember what this collection was called either it was called the blue hydrangea that's what it was called the blue hydrangea um it, and it came with four jumbo dies as well so here's this one so you get this frame and then with love and best wishes so there's that here is the with love and best wishes so cute and then look at this fabulous carnation frame Ooh. or no not carnation it's a daisy daisy frame what isn't that beautiful oh my gosh so fabulous all right so if you're still watching i'm doing a giveaway of these so if you are interested in winning the cuts that i did from these dies then you can leave a comment below you must be a subby an active subby which means i need to recognize your name so if you have not been commenting so forth i won't recognize your name um you need to be a visible subby you need to have been active subby for the last three months 18 or older and um yeah so in the comments below leave a comment about what is your favorite flower um do not say giveaway do not mention anything like that otherwise i will disqualify you okay all right so keep it moving so that was this one <laughs> fabulous love it the next one is this one which was one of my faves so fabulous so this is what it looks like Now I will say it took me a few passes through to get this because my plate is warped. So that's just a little hint. If you have the Gemini and it talks about how well it cuts and I always talk about how well it cuts, the machine itself cuts fabulously. But when your plates start to warp, sometimes it takes a few more passes. All right, the third one in this collection, which is what I love so much, yes is the blue hydrangea and this is its cut how gorgeous right you could cut this in so many ways and then its sentiment it's to you on your special day fab then the last one is this lavender twilight awesome I'm trying to get that glare off like i said they're huge aren't they they're so big um so here's this one i love it here's its sentiment all right then it came with a cd-rom that has background papers and the charisma and then it came with an actual pad of the charisma papers now let me show you how this works so you see this and see how it's extra bleedy you know it doesn't look very crisp so what you do is you put the die on top and then when you cut it out it becomes very crisp and all this extra bleed goes away all right same thing there so they give you a pad with the charismas on it in different colors that you can cut the die in and then the same like see how fuzzy this looks it's because when you cut the die all that extra fuzz will go away um and then they give you they give you different colors no they just gave you the charisma over and over again so they give you that <clears throat> and then here they give you the same charisma but then they give you background papers so you can print that off yeah which will look lovely 
using my Anna Griffin printer. Okay, so there you go. That's my haul. Thanks for watching. See you later. And uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, thumbs up, uh, share, and I shall see you next time. Bye.